and so I was finally able to get a new video card even in the terrible market that it currently is in. Uh, I was able to snag a GeForce RTX 3080 FTW3 Ultra for the win and I'm going to unbox it. already took off the, uh, when it got shipped, still had the uh, factory seal on it and took a box cutter of those so I'm going to finish the job here. Open up for the first time and see what's inside. Already registered on EVGA's website officially. Good to go with anything that would require me to have it registered. So I've got some bracket mounting tools. I won't need that, but we'll we'll hang on to that. Of course, I got some styrofoam here to keep it in place. I got a little booklet or a pamphlet, instructions in a uh, neat kind of layout there. Here's the card itself in the anti-static bag, and this is a thick card. This takes up I think at least two and a half slots, if not three, PCI slots. So we'll. I have to finagle getting this into my case. I'm going to have to rearrange the sound card and whatnot in there. So let me get some of these stickers off to open the open the bag up and see what we have inside. Here we go. Lots of protective material everything safe but there you have it there is the card I'm gonna start taking off some of these plastic and stickers throughout the card to get down to the what's beneath this is where the fun is making sure you get all the stickers off heat sink and you don't want sponges you don't want to have fingerprints on it so thank you EVGA for giving us the stickers <laughs> coming off pretty easily though and it's in its entirety there. Yeah, this is just a massive card. Never seen one this big. You've got the, uh, since it's the FTW3, you got three um, power supply inputs there. So three 8 pin ones, and I think I have an extra one to add to my power supply so I can get the power this this needs. So yeah, and then you have the inputs there of uh, one HDMI and then three display ports, which I think I have a monitor that still has VGA, but I did get an adapter for that so I can use my third monitor still. But yeah, it's a hefty card, it's heavy, it's thick. But it will be exciting to get this up and running. Uh, you got the, the fan set up here. Notice the not totally aligned here. And you've got this is a LED lights up, so I'm messing with that uh, in the future with uh, whatever um, EVGA pre precision software they have. Now there is a little more uh, tape here. See if I can take that off. Might need to get a knife though and get to it that way or uh, something to my fingernail's not quite doing the job. But there's a little bit more tape right there, sticky sticker. But there's the back plate. Got the solid back plate there covering everything up on the PCB. But yeah, there you have it. There's the EVGA model of the 38 3080. FEW3 edition and also the EA's heat fans have some stickers too so 
I'm gonna pop this in and see if we can get it running and start running some games. Oh, also this is, if you look on the box here, uh, you have the LHR edition of this, so that means light hash rate, so this is not uh, gonna be as good for Bitcoin mining, uh, Ethereum, whatever you have. Um, it's gonna it's gonna basically gimp and handicap your ability to do that, which I'm not really mindful of. Don't really care less. Uh, couldn't care less about that. And uh, yeah, I think that's everything. So wish me luck. I'll pop up my case, throw this in, and hopefully get it up and running and uh, playing some games.